Hello everyone and welcome back to Provost Farms here in Stardew Valley. Hope you're all doing well. I'm doing quite well myself. It's Lewis's birthday and I've been a silly pumpkin. <laughs> this void mayonnaise sure would come in handy uh, at the goblin who seems to love void mayonnaise. Because apparently, if you go to the library and you read some books there, there's actually a book that tells you that goblins love mayonnaise, and that's supposed to be the hint that you're supposed to give mayonnaise to the goblin. Hey honey, I made you a hot breakfast. Thank you so much. If you want to get strong, you have to eat like you mean it. Alex, you're so sweet. You're so, so sweet. However, right now, I will actually be going ahead and straight up to the goblin to see what we can do. Hello friend, the mountain lake has been kind to me lately. I'd like to share my good fortune with you. Linus! That is so sweet of you to just give me like a beautiful little, uh, a beautiful little sashimi plate. That's, that's actually really sweet of you. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab all of these. Just the ones that are kind of like, uh, at the edge. And I'm just gonna leave them, uh, like out of that. And I'm probably gonna grab these guys too. There we go. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to, didn't mean to grab you. There we go. And then I'm gonna leave those there, like empty right now, because I am gonna. Oops, sorry, I'm gonna grab those. Because I am gonna like uh, replace those guys with either potatoes or cauliflower, and I don't want to have uh, all the parsnip seeds kind of just like lingering around. So I'm gonna do that later, but I just want to gather them all up right now, so I know what kind of spaces I'm dealing with. Okay, this seems to be kind of a good enough kind of area. I do need to fill up my watering can as well, though. So we'll we'll we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll get there. <laughs> We're doing, we're doing okay guys, we're doing okay, we just need to kind of prioritize how we do things and I forgot where I just left Epina and I'm not too sure. Oh, there you are. Thank you. Do, 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 do. It's also Sunday so we can head down to the lady in the cart, which uh, isn't really like an amazing uh, thing in like my, my our, our to-do list today because we are going to be defeating a witch or hopefully avoiding defeating a witch if we can sneak in and hopefully not pass it. Oh, there's a rabbit! Hello! So you got tomato, we got juice. Let's just buy the juice. Um, tomatoes, battery pack, red plate, duck egg, fairy rose, jojo, festive dining table, and a rare seed. I think I'm going to buy the rare seed just because... And then I do think I need to come back up and have a look at our Iridium statue because I keep forgetting to look at it. I keep forgetting to be like, oh, we're going to get daily Iridium. And I'm just like, oh, no, like we don't even need to acknowledge the daily Iridium that's coming come our way. Thank you. When in fact, it's daily Iridium. Like, I don't understand how I could be that, like... <laughs> Clueless towards daily iridium. Like, do you guys know how much we struggled for iridium? I don't know. So we just got six iridium from that. Like, come on! Like, why do we keep passing that up every single day? Let's come over. Let's pop in our iridium into our little smeltery over here. I don't even think we have any coal to smelt the iridium. That could be a problem. Let's pop you guys up there. We actually don't have any coal, but we do have enough to finally get in iridium quality, I think. So we might actually even go to the Clint's. So let's just come up this way. We can head to Robin's. Oh look, it's the uh, Fairy Rose. Let's run up here, come around, and then hopefully uh, we can uh, we can de defeat this goblin pretty quickly. Hey, Linus. There we go. And let's come this way. Okay, Epony, you wait here for me, okay? There we go. Void mayonnaise. Let's see if he'll talk to us again. You're offering this to me? No, thanks. There we go. The smell. I can't resist. Give me that. Okay, he's just... Thanks. He's... <gasps> this is kind of like our shed. He came in here, though. Where is he? Are you kidding me? There's a teleporter straight to your room, Rasmodius? Honestly. That is probably like one of the worst things that I have actually seen in this game. Because I didn't mean to step on it. I didn't mean to go this far. <laughs> oh my god. 
<laughs> we literally, hello, big in the car. We literally teleported the wrong direction. And then we have to go all the way back. We're probably going to need more Viennese because I bet you the goblin has like uh, finished the Vi mayonnaise. There's like a timer or something on it, I'd say. I cannot quit this game. I cannot right now. Can we please just... Oh my... Hey, Saku. <laughs> I'm so annoyed that I did that. How was I supposed to know that was a teleporter, though? Like, am I just supposed to, like, find, like, know exactly what we're looking for? I know we're looking for ink, but, like, is, like... Maybe the ink was in that red square, you know what I mean? Like, I... Note to self, don't touch the red square. Um... Just wait. Just, just wait and explain. Hello, Epid. It looks like he didn't have to wait for me because I don't need you to, like, get back there. Oh, my God. Okay, good. He's not here. He's not here. He's not here. He's not here. So, what's this? That's it. You found the wizard's lost magic ink. Better return it to him. Okay. Curse of the countryside. A spellbook for the rural witch. Okay. Uh, drink Shrine of Selfishness. Your children return to doves and fly away. No? Dark Shrine of Memory. The statue stares through you. I don't know what this is supposed to do. The Shrine and Magic Seal of Perfection will be lifted, allowing monsters to appear on your farm at night. Make an offering to this on one strange bun. Okay, so we need a strange bun to do that. Which would be kind of cool, because I would actually kind of... Probably be a bad idea to secure art in your arm in here, okay? And what's the witch? Whoever lives here must really like a clean floor. And what about these things? Okay. Right, so let's go. I want to do that. Okay. So now we can talk. Ooh, Rasmodius, hello. You found my ink. Excellent. Ugh. Did you happen to see my ex-wife? No? Well, what about her house? Do you think she lives alone or...? Actually, don't tell me. I don't want to know. Anyway, you must be wondering about your reward. Here. It's a book of summoning. The arcane potential is immense, but I'll make it simple for you. By using this book, you can summon magic buildings directly to your farm. I think you'll find it useful. Oh, I almost forgot to say. Thank you. Alright, okay. I'm down for that. So what, what do we need to do here then? So we need 9 star fruit, 200 star, uh, stone, and fiber? We can do that. We can literally go to the... We can go to the desert, get the star fruit seeds, and grow them. I am down. I am down. And then we'll have like a Junimo hut. Um, excuse me. I want to do that. So let's just drink some more coffee. I also want to see if we have a strange bun. I should get that horseradish. Hey, Jazz. I want to see if we can get a strange bun and like make that offering for the monsters to appear. Because that would be kind of cool. Because obviously our granite did some kind of like magical spell to like, like protect our farm. But having monsters on the farm at night would be kind of nice. Because then we could come back here while we're growing things and like actually like fight things and make things a little bit more exciting on the farm. Hmm. Okay, let's just go ahead first of all and go get those star fruits because it's getting pretty late and I don't want to be like stuck with it without an, an area, you know. Let's go over here. Let's uh, buy a ticket to Calico Desert. Come on. Thank you so much, Pam. She's such a doll. Okay. Thanks. Okay, we got some seeds. And what's over here then? Please be a dinosaur egg. Please be a dinosaur egg. Please be a dinosaur egg. Ah. Seeds. 
I mean, these aren't that bad, but it'd just be nice to get a, an egg every now and again. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Sandy. I need to get uh, nine star fruitsies from you, please. I'm going to go ahead and go overboard and get maybe 16. And that's all we're going to get from you. Thank you. And then I can plant them straight away in the greenhouse so we can just forget about them. So, uh, I'm sorry, Pam. I'm, I'm, I'm going to head home. Perfect. And now we need to head to, I guess we can head to the mines. Let's just head to town first. I'm in here. Uh, shop. Let's get some coal up in here. 45. And then I want to get like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. There we go. At least then that's kind of always growing, you know what I mean? Then let's head up to Pierre's. Do 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 How long does Starfruit take? Thirteen days and we should have a uh, a Junima hut. So thirteen episodes and we should have our very own Junima hut. I don't know why I came into Evelyn and George's house. But um hey guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and sell the coconut, the parsnips, the daffodils, the other parsnips. Uh, I guess I can keep everything else. You're kinda doing pretty well. Ooh, that's a beautiful uh, wallpaper. I'm gonna keep on to that, actually. Let's come out then. And we can drink a coffee. Perfect. And we can head straight up to... Where am I going? Wasn't I supposed to go home first and see if we could find a strange bun? I think I was supposed to go home first and see if I could find a strange bun before we went back. But I suddenly skipped that part and <laughs> I just started running towards the uh, the witch's hut again. Okay, let's do this. It's fine. Uh, bus stop. Let's come down. Thank you, my friend. And let's see if we have a strange bun in our... Uh, in, in our chest up here because we, we do have a lot of items that kind of like do get lingered around and Shane actually does give us a lot of uh, a strange items strange bun strange bun strange bun nothing and what about in here strange bun do we have one don't think we do and do we have a recipe for it? we do so it's periwinkle void mayonnaise so I need, definitely need a periwinkle, and I think you can get one of them from like the crab cages. So it might be a good idea to go down to the, yeah, it might be a good idea to go down to the beach. So let's just pop you up here, I guess, and then we can get the, we can get the iridium as well. What does it take to make the beach totems? Hardwood, coral, and fiber. Do I have that? So let's take you guys out. That was good timing. We'll pop you guys up there and those. So let me just see if I have coral, hardwood, and fiber. So I do have some fiber. So how much is it? It was uh, 10 fiber. Okay. 10 fiber. Any coral? And then hardwood. I thought we had X. Ooh. Give me you. I thought we had hardwood somewhere. Nope. Coral. We don't have a muscle or an, We have those. Okay. Carl's. We don't. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Right, I guess we can just head straight to the beach then, rather than... I was hoping we could warp there. Oh, I should probably grab an aquamarine just in case we see Elliot down there. He is like a little bean, but he's like one of our favorite little beans. Oh, and if you guys didn't know, I'm actually doing an alternative Let's Play on uh, Twitch at the moment, where I'm trying to pursue, uh, pursue different avenues of uh, romance and adventure on Stardew, and we can see what way we do our farm there. So let's come down this way. 
I love how we're like trying to actively seek out monsters now. Oh look, and there's our little mermaid. It's for me, marvelous. I've read all the great romantics, delved deep into poetry and settled myself with the romance of words. Yet nothing I can read can describe quite him with so What? Elliot, you're so cute. Ooh, is that a periwinkle? Muscle. Oh, it's just a muscle. Unfortunately. Willy, you're not here? How do I... Okay, I can do that then, can't I? Yeah. Okay. And then I have three, and I can drop these three down here, right? And I can just do another one, like, there. And then I can do this. Okay, so hopefully that'll work. And we'll get a periwinkle, because that would be kind of nice. Hey, Elliot. Anything over here, there's a muscle. You. Can I fill up my watering can here? Oh, there's coral. We do need coral. Uh, how many coral? We got one coral. So we're going to have to get another little, like... Kind of trip to the beach, I guess. Unless Shane wants to go ahead and gift us something. We're kind of stuck right now. So I guess we'll head home and sleep. No, we have to plant the star fruits. I'm going to plant the star fruits up there and the rare seed, actually. There we go. That's what I need to do. And I'm not going to be deterred. Oh, we ran out of coffee as well. Damn. It's okay. All we need to know is that we're getting Junimos pretty soon. We're and then we're getting monsters on our farm. Okay, that's all we need to kind of figure out, and that's all we need to do right now. Monsters on the farm, Junimos. Monsters on the farm, Junimos. Okay, we will be good to go with that. <laughs> it's gonna take a little bit of a time, but we're, we'll get there. Okay, so let's come up here. Let's sell everything. So we need to sell broken CD, the mussels, the clams. We can sell the driftwood and the oysters. Everything else I do need to keep, so I'll pop you down there. Pop you up there, because we do need that. We can sell that, 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 that. We're going to keep all of you guys there. Come down this way. I do need to water these guys. And then I do need to, like, plant some more stuff down here. And I should definitely be smelting, or sorry, brewing some more coffee for the morning. So let's go ahead and do that. There you go. Pop you up there. And then let's come into the greenhouse and plant these bad boys down. These little uh, star fruit seeds. Hey, we got some uh, small little blueberries. It's pretty nice. I am going to take the... Oh, look at that. We did get coffee beans, though. That's so pretty. Okay, let's grab those and you guys. And let's grab you guys, too. You and you. I'm gonna grab you and you. And then I think I need a third one. Okay. So let me just see if I can. Oh. I need to pop you guys down there. There we go. So I'm gonna keep you there. One there. Maybe water all these guys. Thank you. And don't think I don't see you, coffee beans, because I do. Okay. And then we'll have, like, one here and one here. And then we'll put down all the star fruit seeds. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And then the rare seed we can pop here. And I'll just go get some more blueberries. Like blueberry seeds from in here. Um, oh, we we had more star fruit. Come on here. Can I pop this down before I do it? Has to be had before planting. Okay. Uh, let's do that, and then we'll plant the extra three star fruit seeds. There we go. Perfect. So that's gonna be like our little like sweet gem star fruit uh, blueberry section. Which is perfect. We'll pop you guys up here and then we'll sell everything else. 
Oh, that was an exciting day. We did we did quite well. That like we did very well. I, like I'm not gonna lie. Like I'm very happy that we're getting Junimos. I'm very happy that we're getting everything else. Like I think we might be getting everything. Obviously, except the seller. Like we're gonna have to make more money for the seller. But we could do that. So let me just see. So we need six, 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 and six. And then we can pop those up there. And then we can make some more of these sprinklers. Perfect. So I think we need more iron and more quartz. So I'm gonna make like maybe three. And then maybe four iron. Or sorry, three iron. So we're gonna leave that up there. I do wanna head back over to the greenhouse just to drop down another one of those beautiful little last uh, sprinklers. Because like we have six sprinklers, we might as well use them for the coffee beans. There's no point in us not using them. So let's just pop down the coffee beans over here. And then we just need to fill back up that whole area. So we'll actually do pretty, pretty well over here if we if we can get more coffee beans. Like I would I really, really appreciate that. Okay, let's come back in. We should probably smell some more coffee for the morning. Just so everything's kind of uh so we have like a good uh good stockpile of coffee. Okay, and I'm gonna pop up a hundred coffee. We should always have a hundred coffee in this by the end of the day. Like, always. And if we don't, we need to replenish it ASAP, you know? Because if we run out of that, we're gonna run out of, like, speed things, things to go around the place, things to do things. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be a bit of an issue. Okay, the quartz already done. The iridium is already done, which is perfect. So we can probably go ahead and make an iridium quality um, tool for tomorrow. So let's pop you guys up there, because I do need to make you guys. There we go. So let's pop you up, you up, and then let's take you guys down so we can make you. And let's just sell everything else. So let's sell the honey. Coffee beans, blueberries, we might as well just sell the coffee bean seeds as well. Fiber we can keep, everything else we can kind of keep. So we're kind of, we're doing better than we, we originally would have thought we're doing. You know what I mean? Like we're, do, we're doing, we're doing way better. I think anyway. Because we have an iridium quality thing. So if you guys want to vote on what we should make into iridium quality, I'm kind of going for the, the watering can to be honest. But thank you guys so much for watching. It's been a complete pleasure and... Goodbye.